Hey guys, you broke your bears, and welcome to the review for episode 2 of season 6 of Game of Thrones. In the spirit, we're in a Game of Thrones t shirt, of course. Winter is coming. Eh? Eh? Don't forget that. So, what happened in episode 2? Oh, wow. Episode 2. Episode 1 was good. Episode 2 blew it out of the fucking wars. No contest. Let's. I dare say, it's the most interesting cliffhanger episode I think I've ever seen. So, the talking points. Hmm. Ramsay is now Lord Bolton after killing Roos Bolton and, and the uh, the lady Roos Bolton had a baby with. Oh, he also killed the baby. Because, you know, it is Ramsay. Reek, also known as Sion, has decided he wants to go home. Hmm. Unfortunately, he won't get to see his father because Balon Greyjoy is also dead. Killed old, old by e, e, the appearance of his brother. Or so, old, the uh, Greyjoy family drama. Uh, will be uh, taken to a new level well, probably in the next episode because Ara Yara huh? uh, is looking to become head of the Ironborn but obviously and she has said she's gonna find out who killed Bela and Greyjoy and she's gonna make them pay all she doesn't know what happened mm. Mm. No mess and she's she, something is gonna happen with her her uncle in um in episode three. The Wildlings attacked Winter um not Winterfell. Oh that's a layer. <laughs> they attacked Castle Black and, and helped over easily overpower the assholes who stabbed John. Only like two casualties, unfortunately. I mean, hmm, the little fucking ass cunt didn't get killed. They were thrown in cells. So Davos asks the Red Lady if she can bring John back. So she cleaned him off. She cut some of his hair off. She cut some of his beard off 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 and she's I'm, I'm guessing she said the same words your man said to the guy the hound killed back when the Arya was traveling with with um with them with the brand of with the brand band of brothers I think it, they were called I think that's what that group was called hold hold no, he was trying to save the guy who the hound had rammed his sword through his shoulder or and killed. And he brought him back from the dead for like the fifth or sixth time. So, oh, she does that. And everyone leaves thinking, I'm get they didn't say anything. But from the looks, I, I gathered that they felt it didn't work. So maybe they're going to build a pyre. But right after Sadawas left, he was the last one to leave. So just Ghost and John were left in the room. And then, and these are the big spoilers in case you haven't seen the episode. Oh, Oh, but if you're watching this, or you don't care, or you have seen the episode, Ghost, Ghost who was kind of like sleeping on the floor, her lifts his head up, looks towards John, and bang, his eyes open. Yes, Jon Snow is back. The worst kept secret in television history, because we all knew he was coming back. But yes, John is back. Interesting. Be yeah, uh, very interesting. Wonder if if uh, because 
sounds like Sansa is heading to Castle Black. I wonder if John will mention hmm, that he was technically dead for a bit. <laughs> I don't know if that will come up. Maybe it will. Uh, there in King's Landing, Tommen has asked, asked the, um, his mother, Cersei, to help make him mm, strong. So, obviously, he, Cersei's probably thinking, this is brilliant. I can now get in control over him. Maybe turn him against, against um, Marjorie. He can stop her from controlling him. I'll see. That's, that's just speculation on what she might have been thinking. Uh, the High Sparrow came into the Red Keep where they have the uh, funerals of the people who die. He, where they were having Marcella's funeral. Oh. And he brought along with him the He had guys with him, but he was saying to Jamie, he, he, oh, you'd spill blood in this holy place, and Jamie's line is, oh, obviously, if you've seen the trailers and, or the episode, you know he said, it, well, the gods have spilled more blood than all of us, so. Basically, Jamie was calling the sparrow, high sparrow out on his bullshit by saying, hey, you judge them for their crimes. What about me? I've I've done practically more. Her. Her. And it was cool to see Jamie almost was daring the High Sparrow to try something. And, 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 which to be fair, he didn't. And, but it's Something is going to happen in the next couple episodes with the High Sparrow and the, the Lannisters, so it should be interesting. Um, one of the guys who was taunting Cersei when she did her war walk of shame last season got killed by the, the zombie mountain. Hmm? He was taking this and he turned around there's a mountain. BANG! His head splattered across the wall. Oh, oh, it was awesome. So <laughs> yeah. So in uh in Bravos, this 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 the uh other girl came to beat Aya up with a stick again, and Aya was you know, she was swinging, she was swinging, trying to hit. You won, but she had disappeared. Be interesting to learn how they did that. Um, obviously editing, but you know how they're gonna explain that in the show. Obviously, I had to see it because you know she's still blind. But then Jagan Harga, her daughter, shows up and stops her from hitting him, and he's asking her questions. And her answer is, is, the girl has no name. The girl has no name. And the girl has no name. Because he kept asking her for her name. Obviously, he, 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 not, I guess maybe he was, hoping, obviously, he got the answer I think he was looking for. Obviously, he, she, he was testing her to make sure she wouldn't say that she was Aya Stark. She indeed is beginning to believe that she in fact is no one. So that train is going well. And um, beyond the wall, we saw the return after a season-long absence of Bran, and uh, he saw a little uh, flashback to when. His uncle Benjamin and his dad were kids. He saw the uh, he for the first time. He saw uh, his uh, his aunt and hmm? 
Mutant, the one who uh, was killed in the uh, infamous Tower of Joy, he that the book careers also who who happy to remind us that they know everything about, and we he people who just want to watch the show who don't care about until they show it to us. It doesn't fucking matter. So. He saw that. He also saw that Hodor actually he used to talk more than Hodor. Yeah, he used to say more than that. He used to be a stable boy. Obviously, I, I kind of hope they'll explain what happened to Hodor that made him, I guess, an imbecile. Maybe he took a blow to the head, and and he just kept repeating Hodor so that they. They called him that, I don't know. Well, something, hopefully, something will happen with that in the next couple of episodes. Um, I'm trying to think, is there anything else? Oh, yeah, Marine. In Marine, Tyrion says, well, we have two dragons. Let's release them and let them take... Well, he didn't say th this line, but pretty much, I'm pretty sure this is his thinking. Obviously, he's... I, I'm guessing that his thinking is if we... he let the dragons out, they will take back Marine with our mother. Who... Who, apparently, they haven't et. They have... They've, stopped eating since she left. Obviously, maybe they know she's gone? Hmm? He, he, un, he unchained them, but they didn't fly out. Well, they didn't show them flying out. They stayed in the, uh, under the pyramid where they were. But they're unchained. He has them loose. So, big, big stuff is going to happen in the next couple of episodes. So, yeah, all in all, this episode, brilliant. Glyph hanger felt perfect. Every, not, it, it didn't feel like, you know, they showed enough that once, that makes me feel, ah, why is it only one episode out of week? But, it, it's a good Cliffhanger, you know, sometimes when you leave stuff on a cliffhanger, you have to leave it on a sad tree note, and they did that very, very well. Oh, very, very carefully and very, very well. Oh, I said that twice, but yeah, overall, a brilliant episode. Like I said, it let me know your, your thoughts of, of episode two of season six, home. Game of Thrones and, and thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please smash the like button if you did. Subscribe for more videos very, very soon. And until next time, winter is coming. Peace.